జీవానిన show you guys what i just saw my husband came back for break he finished eating and went outside when he stepped out he told me that he's going back i said okay but i noticed that he came in again but i didn't know what he came to do in my mind i was thinking maybe he came in to use the bathroom you know that was what i thought and i was busy in the kitchen washing some dishes i came inside the room now let me show you guys what i saw like i saw it i had to pick my camera so i will show you guys let me just show you guys what i saw this is what i saw that it it was not something that was in this house before and i saw i saw the shirt like i'm like he didn't even tell me look at obvious I also find this one on top of my dressing table like I don't know I'm like let me just show you guys see how I'm looking that's to tell you that I was busy in the kitchen I wasn't filming any video and nothing like I wasn't doing any vlog and he just did this I'm like he has gone to work oh. he didn't tell me I have to send him a message <laughs> that I saw his handwork guys and this is nice for you if he's about doing something for you he's not going to tell you you just see it this is him i feel like i need to talk if i say let me leave it later i might forget the things this moment will want me to say growing up i watched my parents marriage so beautiful filled with love unity and understanding but sometimes when i hear story of what is happening in other people's marriage people that are living in our streets neighbors and because my parents were ministers so a lot of people come for counseling for marriage issues so sometimes i'll be wondering why can't other people's marriage be like my parents marriage not to say that my parents had perfect marriage but the understanding the positive side of their marriage was bigger and greater than the negative part and i don't know how they did it but they did it in a way that we only saw the beautiful part of their marriage i don't know if they at any time they had it but i didn't know i didn't know how they were able to do that and i always tell god to please help me even though i know that i'm not perfect i'm not perfect but i want to live a life that my children will always talk about me the way i'm talking about my parents now as a single girl i always prayed and wish that i will have a marriage that is filled with love because if you know me you know that i love love i love romance i never wanted a marriage that immediately after the honeymoon phase everything will just fade away like immediately after six months one year of marriage everything will just fade away they'll be living like normal you know no i didn't want it i wanted a marriage where i will always have that feeling of love there are little little things i always say it things that keep marriage keep the fire of marriage burning are just little little things and for me this is one of it sometimes when we see this type of thing is in relationship or in the movie i'm not saying that husbands don't buy things but not just buying it but the way you would just do it you know maybe if my husband came in and gave me this thing i would love it i would appreciate it but not the way it make me feel now right now like i'm feeling so loved i'm having that feeling of the first time i met my husband and this is what we need in marriage you always need to feel you always need to have that feeling few months from now my marriage will be seven good years yes guys and this is everything i prayed like for a man i didn't want a man that there is nothing like romance like men are not too romantic but at least there are things that women want you know little little things that you can do that will turn their head i'm not somebody that is materialistic like 
you have to give me the whole world but i appreciate any little thing and the way you present it to you it might be what is it was it was it's just a shirt mm -mm. it's not just a shirt not that he cannot give me money and say buy the shirt but there's this feeling that comes when you always think and you know that your husband got your back anytime any day i'm just grateful that at this stage of my marriage with everything we have faced together with all the challenge we have been through with how many years we have been living together i still experience this like it's not new it's not something that I, today is the first time we have days that we have our own misunderstanding we disagree yes of course we have to disagree over some things to agree but the positive aspects of our marriage is better bigger than the negative aspects of marriage like marriage is not as bad as it's been painted marriage is beautiful and marriage can be enjoyed you can enjoy marriage you don't necessarily need to endure marriage yes marriage is easy but it requires hard work understanding i don't know just look for things little things that you can do for your partner to spice up everything for me these are the things that my husband does that scatters my head like i didn't have any idea that such a thing is going to happen Look at how I was looking now. I'm grateful. I pray for my husband that God will continue to bless him for me. God will continue to make him the first in everything he do in life. He will live to enjoy the fruit of his labor. More money. More contract. More promotion in his working place good health he will live to see his fourth generation in jesus name and i'm going to give him twins in jesus name amen i'm so emotional right now forget how i'm looking i know but i have to do it because i will always come back and watch it okay guys tell me in the comment section are you like me i hate like i dislike cooking on sundays like in my own dictionary in my own brain cooking on sunday is not proper that is my own opinion though. i feel like sundays are for resting day even when growing up that was how we did it in our house anything that we we're going to eat on sunday my mom will go to everything on saturday and this is how i love doing it i can't imagine myself coming back from church and i'll enter kitchen start cooking rice start cooking stew no so guys i want to make let me show you banga stew i'm always happy whenever i'm cooking and eating banga stew like that stew far there is something inside that stew that you cannot get elsewhere like there is no stew i can use to compare ofaku 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 is is b is lit is everything is tanti fire
You look beyond me, oh, you look beyond me, yeah. And I'm the one that you have shown mercy, you have shown mercy, you look beyond me, yeah. done from service service was so beautiful was so reviving i had fun and i enjoyed myself in the presence of my father yes guys we're on our way home now but we want to get some fuel before going home and i think i want to go and take some pictures please follow me on instagram at ozitochi there you are going to be seeing a lot there you are going to be seeing beautiful side of me like follow me on instagram and over there we can be having one-on-one -on -one conversation you know chatting and encouraging each other so it's important follow me on instagram let's go there and have fun i can't wait to go home and eat my banga stew of you remember now i made yesterday i ate rice yesterday oh, yes i cooked rice after i finished making it i ate rice this morning i just took a glass of orange juice and one slice of bread like i don't eat in the morning but i needed to put something inside my tummy so when i get home now first of all i'm going to clean my house because i can't function in an disorganized house when my house is disorganized i can't function know that the house is in a mess but i need to make everywhere to look kinky and i'm going to eat and after eating we are going to relax watch movie and that will be a wrap so guys let's in four days from today it's going to be three weeks 21 days and the hair is still looking so beautiful hmm? so guys yeah i deserve it And I admire secret and open admirer. Boy, you got me mega mama. I need me mama. Go ahead, see get me mama. It's not a game. It's a red skin. Disturbing me like eh? Jesus. The, do you know when I mean disturbance? He has just been disturbing me since this afternoon. I can't this one is not even hiding. He has been disturbing me. Come on. Eh? <laughs> Guys, food, food is ready. He's eating his own over there. I don't know if you that. Is that man there with a white top eating the food I prepared? Sabi. So go, so go Jesus, let me see if I'm okay. Beans, beans and plantain. You cook, but I cooked the beans now. You just mixed it with the plantain. You not cook it, you help me. Boil it. It is so. Can I now do my video? <sighs> Guys, nice. Nah, me, but let's continue. We move. Obviously, you people can see what I'm rocking now. You people can see this hair. Uh, hey, see the man, the man that bought the shirt. This one that is on my side. The man, the man. <laughs> that man the over man. there. He bought this shirt for me, placed it on top of the bed, went back to work. I came in, I saw it, and I'm rocking it today. Nah, it is very romantic, but you're a little bit romantic. 
Then I'm not romantic. Okay. But that thing you did now, you did it in a romantic way now. Uh -huh. Oh, to you, you might not see it as putting in extra work, but for me, this is just what women want. See, it doesn't. I gave you surprise, no? Eh? I gave you surprise, so. Yeah, eh? you would have just, you know, when you came into the house, you would give it to me. But why did you go inside, place it on the bed, and went out? That method of presentation is a romantic. To you, you don't see it as. Romance or romantic. This is what women see as Romantic way or treating a woman with a lot of romance for me. I don't know Women never believe that men are romantic so You know, you have agree You don't do anything on romantic You do things we do because we, we love our wife. We want to do good to them So we, we don't count about romantic these days Mm -hmm. Does you guys never believe that women are romantic? Almost all the women they do say it. The way you presented this t shirt to me, you did it in a romantic way. That's mm -hmm. what I have to say. This is what women see as. Maybe men used to think that when we talk about romantic, it means going extra, extra. No, just little things like this. It doesn't matter how much or what is that thing you bought, but the way you present it, the way you talk to us, the way you spend quality time with us, the sweet name you call us, telling us how beautiful we are, this is what we need. And we're going to give you everything you want. <laughs> Thank you so much for this beautiful shirt and the romantic way you gave it to me. I love it. No, you're romantic. No, you're a romantic man. <laughs> Team romantic. Hey, 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 hey. Team romantic. No, you're romantic. But when you be saying that you're not romantic, I didn't even know. I know. I know you're romantic. It's just that you don't want to accept it. Not that you are really, really romantic. I don't even understand what you people think I would think is romantic. Now, sometimes self uh, people will not be able to explain that which is too romantic. This even thing you did now is romantic. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Is it the first time I've done it? It's not the first time. That, I told them now that this, that is why I said you are 50% romantic. I'm 50%. Don't give me any, any percentage of that. No. Zero. No, you are 50% romantic. Zero. You are 50% romantic. Or right, stop doing the, this type of things now. I don't agree with you. Well, I'm not running away from being romantic to be fun. <laughs> uh, okay, you are not romantic, you are Roman. Nah, he doesn't want to be romantic, but he's doing romantic things. Be fun. Judge this matter. Okay, now. Just look for a way and make your spouse happy. Just no matter how small it is, he or she is going to appreciate it. Just the way, like this shirt really brightened my day. The way the manner he presented it really made me happy. That day. and he he knows. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, leave a comment, share, tell a friend, to tell a friend, to tell a friend, to tell a friend, to tell a friend about the Woti couple living in Italy. They are going to love us. Okay, we're going to see you in our next video. Have a wonderful day.